Most researchers studying cancer focus their work on the biology of the tumor itself. Michele Petrizelli, a member of Erwin Wagner's group at the Spanish National Cancer Research Center, Thaneo, in Madrid, decided to approach the cancer problem by considering the rest of the organism. As published in the recent Cell Metabolism paper, the researchers found that what potentially kills one-third of cancer patients is a fat-burning process that is heavily studied for its beneficial effects to fight obesity. Most of the fat in an adult human being is white adipose tissue, and its main role is to store energy. Brown fat, instead, is burned to generate heat, as it happens in babies and hibernating animals. By turning white fat into brown, cancer patients develop cachexia, a syndrome that causes extreme thinness and weakness. This syndrome is likely responsible for the death of one-third of cancer patients and not the progression of the tumor itself. Researchers state that cachexia symptoms improve if the conversion of the adipose tissue is neutralized, for example, by preventing inflammation, a hallmark of cancer, thus offering a promising new therapeutic pathway. The possible identification of biomarkers to identify patients that are likely to develop cachexia would lead to treating them preventatively. This work has been supported by the Fundación BBVA, the European Research Council and the Spanish government.